Paulding County Sheriff Jason Landers says his jail is the most secure storage space in the state of Ohio. And that's because it's been closed since 2008. As News Channel 15's Kelly Roberts reports, he's now asking voters to help reopen it and pay more in taxes. This intake room in the Paulding County Jail is used every day. You can even see some artwork from inmates. But beyond this room, the jail remains closed. So this is the jail library portion that we're required by the state to have. The Paulding County Jail can house 52 inmates, but where the inmates would sleep is used for meetings. Unfortunately, over the past several years, we've utilized this to host meetings. And storing county records. You called it the most secure storage area in, in the state in of Ohio. Ohio. Absolutely. That's what I tell people. After passing a levy to build the jail in 2002, it was open for less than two years. Before it was closed, three different operating levies these were shot down by voters. The powers that be in November of 2008 chose to shut down the Paulding County Jail. So it had been operation from June of 2007 until November of 2008. Right now, all inmates are housed in neighboring Putnam County, costing Paulding County taxpayers more than $325,000 a year. So, Sheriff Jason Landers is putting a 3.5 millage levy on the November ballot so voters can choose whether to create funding to fully open the jail or not. Sheriff Landers says he wants to keep county tax money in the county, and this is the election to try again. You know, we just decided that the time is now. I mean, we feel like this is going to be a big election that a lot of people are going to come out, which would give us a larger pool of people to express themselves. However, if the levy does pass, property taxes would increase. You know, we, we try to we use a round figure. At, if your house is valued at $100,000 in the auditor's office, you're, you're paid taxes at 35% of that. So you would pay taxes on $35,000. And, and at 1.35 mil, that comes out to just over $40 a year. Coming up at 6, hear the timeline on when this jail could reopen if the levy is passed. Reporting in Paulding County, Kelly Roberts, News Channel 15.